Oh, right. Hi. Hi. Um, <laughs> I had a bit of an issue on my phone. That's why I was dithering a second ago. Right, the reason we didn't do a video on the 28th or the 29th, I am losing days, I don't know what day it was, was because I was very, very sick and I was in bed all day. Um, but I'm better now. I had a massive headache. It's to do with this, this COVID thing. And I am so bunged up. But we wanted to wish you a Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Uh, and we have our, our um, the, the, the purple one, this, this, this one. Chocolate, hazelnut and caramel. You saw us review it. Well, we also want to say a very big thank you because we've got 44 subscribers. Yes, and thank, thank whoever has subscribed. I am really, really grateful. Yep. We'd love some comments and maybe even, should I sort of like to have a fight and say, can we have some likes, please, as well? <laughs> because there's algorithms and things I don't understand. Now, we did try and do a live. I did do a video about this and it went really wrong. Because the first one, we looked like we were in a, a, a Japanese, Chinese, Hong, Hong Kong, Kung Fu film. And yeah, it was really flying bad. stomachs of death or something. Yeah. And I apologise for that. But, we, you know, if we can get 50, I can start doing it on my phone. Also, when I get my new phone next month, I'll be unboxing it on here. So you'll see it first. Well, with me. Um, and... Because I'm really looking forward to that. Um, and it's just, if we can get 50, 50 subscribers, then I can do lives out and about. And it'll, because obviously we go out, we go, we don't go out, we go on holiday and things quite a lot. And I can do like a live at the airport or... Oh, you shouldn't be drinking cream-based stuff when I'm this bung now. I can do like a live at the airport or a live... I can't do a live on the plane because there's no internet, but... You know, I can like do lives out and about and, and I can take you guys with me. Um, and I think that'd be really cool. Um, but we can get nine, not nine, it's not nine, it's six. Six more subscribers. Andy boy, can I move you please? Then we can um, do some lives when we're out and explain to you what's actually going on. Because doing a video after, or doing a video when I'm there and then like you seeing it after, is a bit of a butthead, really, isn't it? Maybe so because you can't ask us a question. No, and if you're like, oh, well, what's that? that? And then you ask me afterwards, I'm like, well, what was what? <laughs> and it's like, if I can actually do it when we're there, and I, I can do a live when we're there, and you ask me a question, I'll be like, oh, well, that is whatever it is, you know, and I can show you it closer, or, or obviously I couldn't do that in the water with the swans and that, but, you know, I could do something closer up if it's possible. Um, like when I did actually do the video of the beach and you didn't see the, the seals or the, the the swans because it was just too far out and I was trying to zoom in and it just didn't work. I was getting everything but what I wanted, which was a bit of a pain. So now we've got the new camera. Yeah, I've got my new camera and I'm getting a new phone. So. And we've got to get the laptop sorted. Right? Yeah, right. this one's work. Yeah, so, I've got to take it to the Apple shop in Stratford, but it's a trek to Stratford that I'm not looking forward to going to, so. But thank you so much for subscribing to us. It does mean the world to us. And as you notice, we've been a lot more consistent with our videos now. I mean, it may not mean a lot to you, just pressing the button, but it means the world to us. And thank you so much. And um, yeah, so if we can get like six more subscribers, I can do lives outside. Which would be good. And I don't always look like this. Sometimes I look worse. And I apologise for this chestiness, but... It... Yeah, because I... <laughs> Although the actual cough and the, the fever subsided, I am so bunged up. I am... She's got a new skirt on that I got her for Christmas. Yeah, I can't really model it, but... Yeah, yeah, I'm Is there? It. <laughs> it, I'm, I've got it on my body and I... Yeah, it, 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 is, it is on me. It's spider webs <laughs> and spiders, which she hates. Yeah, but I like the skirt. So yeah. I, but yeah, it is on my body, but then again, so is a cat. So. And that came from Timu. I'm not going to tell you how much it was, but it came from Timu, I think. Did it come from Timu? I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty see, sure I've it did, yeah. i got a cat on me. And... That's little man. Yeah. yeah. I've got Annie next to me, what's new? <laughs> I've got a smudge on, next to me as well, so. 
But um, thank you for the subscriptions. Uh, we're very, 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 very grateful. Um, and I've got an itchy nose. Um, yeah, as I said, sorry. As I said, we've been a lot more consistent with our videos now. Um, I don't know why we're being more consistent with our videos. Because we've got more subscribers now. This is true, yeah. So, you know, the more subscribers, the more consistent we'll be. If we say we're going to do a video, we have to do it then because we're, like, committed. Although we are, we are sort of sticking to what we said, apart from the other day when I was so sick, I couldn't move. I couldn't get out of bed. And then mum was moaning at me going, get out, and I couldn't. <laughs> it's just that at the moment, with this bungled up penis, I'm going to have to take some expectorant because this is just stupid. This is my new, my, one of my new, this was actually supposed to be little man's collar, but we'd already got him one. We didn't know we'd got him one, and we'd already got him one. And we got him this one, but it was too big, just we too big. We got them all new fancy collars for Christmas. Yeah, look at his, he's standing on it. Ralphie's already broken his. Tiggy broke his, but I fixed it. Andy's, he won't break his because it's bling. Anyone who knows Andy. Oh, bling boy. Oh, bling bling boy, he, he won't break his. She's got the art of the ocean and pearls. You can't see it. Put your head up. It's, you can't really see it. There. And all it's right, got all some right. Stop. Pearls on it. Stop freaking out. They were all from Timu. They were quite a good price. Um, Andy's is like a diamond band. And it's actually got a bone on it because it's for a chihuahua. But you don't care. Yeah, but all our cats have actually got their pretty new collars on, which are not going to last much past New Year. They're not going to be there. Andy's will. They're not going to be around for long, I don't think. Andy's will. Andy's probably will, but the rest of them... I mean, he had his collar on for about two years before, and it, the only problem with it was a few don't want you to fall in that, because he's very careful with his, because it's bling. Now, this is my new bracelet as well that I got in my advent calendar, which is really, really cool. And we want to get one for Little Man. Yeah, what's he done to his collar? Oh my god. I don't know, I can't. <laughs> Ralphie's really broken his. I don't know how he's really right. broken his, but he has. I don't know what he's been doing with it. But that's Ralphie for you, and he's a tatty little sod. So. <laughs> They've got some really cute charms on them, and that's the reason we got them. He's got the Grim Reaper on his, and Little Man's got a little black cat on a broomstick. And he's got a bone. She's got the heart of the ocean. And Gremlin's got a little diamondy heart. I said it's quite funny because Gremlin's, she's 10. And Ralphie, I said... I love you dearly, but you're a mess. It's like Gremlin's got on something that I would wear. And and, and um, Smudge's older has got something on that my mum would wear. So it's quite well, funny. Although it's a mess. He's got a little... You, you can't little... see it because he's just in a weird position. It's there, you can't really see it. It's a little Grim Reaper. He's such a mess. He's yeah. really wrecked this car. Well, that's Ralphie. He is a mess. But Andy's... Come here, baby. This is my boy. Everybody knows Andy boy. And... That's not that one. That's his bracelet. Yeah, I know. You're not happy about this, are you? Where is it? There's there's his collar. So, like, a diamond band. And where is it? And there's his bone. So, yeah. He's still got all these diamonds on that, which is amazing. But then again, like I said, he doesn't break anything because he, he does this weird thing and if he breaks one of his collars and it's got bling on it, he'll look at it on the floor and be upset. We came in once and he broke, because he's got a bracelet around his neck. He's got a, what's it called? A chambon? A chambla. A chambla. A chambla. One of them bracelets, one of the balls, and it's got diamonds on it, and he's got a double banded one now because he had one that was glass. That like, I bought it for me, and I put it on him because I thought, oh, you know, he looked cute, and I'll just leave it on for him for like a month or two. No. He ended up wearing it years, and it broke. The actual string broke. The glass balls didn't or anything, they were fine, but the actual string broke. And we came in, and he was sitting on the floor in front of it, looking at it, all sad, weren't he? And I was like, oh, you broke your bracelet. And he just like looked at me and I was like, okay, we'll get you another one. And we got him another one. He broke that one. <laughs> and now he's got that one on. He hasn't yet managed to break. But it's a matter of time. 
I, I have faith that he will break it. So, has uh, anybody got any any New Year resolutions? I have to think of mine. If you had, it would be really nice if you'd share them with us. I think mine's actually is going to be to lose weight this year. Lose weight and that keep the uh, healthy eating. And yeah, that. yeah. Yeah. So, I think... Mean, What's yours? Pretty much the same. Yeah. It's It's been the same for, like, the last 10 years or so. Well, mine used to be to stop biting my nails, but I've stopped doing that now, so... It was a long time coming, but it, it, it worked. Yeah, well, we've done the Christmas clean, and I sacrificed my nails to that. Oh, I, I did too, but I haven't bit them. It was not to bite them, and I haven't bit them. And also, I I'm, I'm, don't think I'll ever be getting them done again. Because the first time I had my nails done, I fell out of a cupboard. I oh, know it sounds stupid. We had this little bulkhead cupboard in um, Delaware Road. You probably remember it, Leo. And I was putting something in there and I fell out. Is that the one that was under the stairs? Yeah. And I fell out the cupboard. And as I fell, I put my head down to stop myself. And I laid it all that one down. And it split my natural Yeah, mine down. split too. And it still split. So I don't know whether I'll ever bother getting them redone. Again. I was on a bus. And I was going up the stairs, and uh, I put my hand on the rail, and the bus moved, and it pulled, it yanked my nail, and it split my nail. Yeah, and I hate it when you wrench it and... Yeah, it breaks it off. In Lanzarote, I literally ripped my own natural nail off, and the nail, the, yeah, I know. the false nail, so I don't know whether I'll be bothered, I'll, I'll bother getting them done professionally again. I think I'll just go with my press-ons. I haven't succeeded in my drinking yet because I got up at four. Yeah, you got up incredibly late. We got up about four and I had to do my makeup and that. And uh yeah, but we didn't go to bed until like eleven. I am. Um, yeah. So um <coughs> I got up at four and did my makeup and that which took about an hour, which is good for me, really, because it, it my makeup takes a long time, and also I've got glitter on my lips, and that's it, you know, and glitter on my eyes. So. Took a while, and had to do my hair and that, and get dressed. And I came downstairs, went on The Sims for a little while because she was watching your Finders Beefers. And then I've just come on in to do this, and that is actually my first drink of the night, and that is the Bailey's, which doesn't, I mean, yeah, it's got a kick to it because you can taste the whiskey in it, but it doesn't really. It's not that strong. And I really shouldn't have picked a cream based one. Stop my drinking with when I'm this bunged up, but We have hey rum. Ho. We have rum. I don't know if that'll be good or not. Rum. Oh, or oh, archers. We've got archers. Yes, you will. Tonight, yes, you will. You have to have a drink at midnight as well as seeing the new year. Let them was the rules, mate. But we've had a few fireworks already. Yeah, and we know that it will turn into the blitz. Anyone who doubts this, just watch the one we did before when it was turning 2020. And you will hear... 2020, wasn't that 2021? It's turning 2021. I can't remember. Or 2022. It's, it's the last New Year one on there. And all you can hear at, towards the end of the video is just fireworks. Yep. It sounds like there's an air raid. <laughs> but if, um, if I'm not too drunk, I'll see if I can get a video of the fireworks and post it on YouTube for you guys. Um... Because the thing is, I get my mum to it, but she don't know how my phone works. And I'm so bunged up, I can't... Everything's bunged up. It's not just... Your hands my, still work. My hands still work. My eyes don't work. My ears don't work. Your eyes never work. I know, but they're worse than usual. But, um, yeah, I'll try and get a video uh, of the fireworks That's at midnight. I've been crying because I was watching Phantom of the Opera. Yeah, I know. I said once, right? So I said, put floor on doing it. She watched it four times. Do you know, she does this thing where I'll like a song and I'll, be, I'll put the song on and then she'll put it on again and again and again and I get sick of it. It's like, no more. But it, when she sings it with Henrik Port, it really... Oh. If you don't believe me, watch it yourself. It is just so... Bestie bangers or bestie zangers. Bestie zangers. <laughs> it is just so emotional and... Oh, I love it. But I said, watch it once. No, not her. She watched it up four times. Hey, I didn't say I wanted to watch one with Antonio Banderas, did I? <sighs> no, but somehow you end up watching that one as well. 
Oh, and by the way, Rick Astley's doing seeing in the new year. He's doing the round us in Camden. Now, my mum said she wanted to watch it. And I said no. And she went, why? Because I mean, not seeing in the new year. We're never going to give you up. It's not, he's not going to sing that for the new year, is he? Yes, he said he was. He said he's not going to sing it for the new year because they've got a break for the fireworks anyway. I am not seeing in the new year. Which is we can pause it. We're never going to give you up. It's not happening. I'm not doing it. I'm watching it. No! Oh, Why yeah. are you making me suffer with Rick Astley? Because you're going to suffer. Okay? We all have to suffer something. Now go in my bedroom and listen to some decent tunes. Well, I thought you'd also want to do, watch a karaoke thing with me as well. Maybe. I don't know. You do. I don't know, because it probably be music from this year. And it'd be like crap music from this year, not like good. <laughs> you have the grand day of the Christmas. Ooh. Oh, it's not going to be that, is it? Because it's not Christmas anymore. It is. New Year is still Christmas. It's the last message of Christmas. And I'm going to hold it. Uh, on the telly, the telly channels, they don't play any Christmas music beyond the 25th. Yeah, I do. They put no, a Happy New Year on New Year's Day. Always Happy does. New Year! It's not a Christmas Happy song. New it's Year. A... Happy New Year! It's a bloody New Year song. They're playing that in the middle of Christmas time. Uh, this is how dumb I am. We're in Finland. Uh, I don't know if you know, but Finland's second language is Swedish. Oh, God. And we were on the bus. <laughs> you said this before. And we were going to where we were staying, and the bus, bus that we had to get off off of was part, one stop past the National Museum. And there's me being so knowledgeable on the bus. And I turned around to Katie, we had our friend Mike. Yeah, was, Mika, Mika. Mika. And I went, Naturali Museum. And he said, You said that really well, but it's Swedish. <laughs> yeah, because she said, I can speak Finnish, I can speak Finnish. <laughs> And she went, oh, it's natural, a museum. And he went, that's really good, but that's actually Swedish. She was like, oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> so she got the pronunciation down and everything else, but it weren't Finnish. No, it's Swedish. <laughs> and also another thing was, we was always going on and seeing this, this word everywhere, Helsingfors. Oh, and we Helsingfors. We thought it was a part of Helsinki. Oh, no, it's Swedish <laughs> for Helsinki. And I said to Kaylee, I went, it's Swedish for Helsinki. It wasn't until David told you. And she went, it wasn't, it was the train. Was it the train? And oh. he went, she went, is it? I went, yeah. Are you sure? I went, I'm positive. How do you know this? I went, I just Yeah, know. and you asked David for clarification. And, and she it checked out it out was. on her phone. And she went, I don't know. And I went, David, what? <laughs> I, As David does. Is Helsinki for us Swedish for Helsinki? He went, yeah. I went, there you go. And she went, how did you know? And I went, I, I learned. No, she asked David for clarification. I went, I heard it on the train. And I just checked it out with him. Yeah. And she went, yeah, but that's David. Are you <laughs> sure he knows? So I went up to to you, and I went, he's housing for Swedish fellows. And he went, yeah. I went, see, told you. Oh, so... You mean you ho you're not happy with because he gave you a shot of sambuca and got you really really oh, drunk. He got me very drunk. That was my birthday. Thing, I know. Wasn't it? Yep. Oh, he got me very drunk. Yes. And they're always in the middle of Helsinki, acting like a complete idiot because I was drunk. Wasn't that actually on your birthday as well? I think it was. All I remember is staggering along. Where, you know where, um, we came out of On The Rocks. Yeah. And I was staggering in the direct, general direction of base. Yeah. Staggering, not walking, staggering. You couldn't have been staggering because it was already in On The Rocks at that point. No, when we came out. Oh, why was you going to base? Oh, we weren't. I just decided that I was. Oh, you was just going to base and it was close. And I was staggering off in the general direction of base. And Katie's going, Mum. Mum, mum, and I just remember you her grabbing me and saying, "We're going this way." I was like, "Oh, are we?" And, and yeah. David puts in a cab because she was out. I there. was, I was out of commission. <laughs> yeah, David had to put us in a cab. I just remember sitting in the cab, looking like this. 
And I was sitting in such a position I could see all the street lights and I was counting them. I'm like, wasn't that when I needed a pee so badly that I just went outside the no, house? Oh. No, I was sober then. <laughs> I was very sober then. I wasn't sober when I came back with the sad blue cars. All I remember was getting in, grabbing hold of the wipes. Somehow, without the aid of a mirror, I miraculously managed to take some makeup off. And I went in the bedroom and I was just passed out. And when I woke up, I was on top of the covers and everything else. And the pillow was at the other end of the bed. Well, it's a good job we I didn't put our cases out or you would have been laying on the cases. I don't know what I was doing. Because that was the day before we came home. So. Yeah, and we had to get up early. Yeah, it didn't be just. I um, mean, the lady let us have it until five, which was a blessing because our plane didn't leave until ten. So we did five hours in a in a in the airport, airport, airport. And then she said to me, "Not the longest time." She came from the bibliotheque, and I went, "That's the library." And she goes, "Yeah, library, bibliotheque." I was like, "Okay." Bibliotheque. Yeah. Okay, I didn't know that. Well, in the back of the book, you've got a bibliography. <laughs> oh yeah. Bibliotheque. Yes, library. But um, yeah. So we just wanted to wish you a happy New Year. We want to wish everyone the happiest of New Years. Tell us your resolutions. Comment and tell us your resolutions. Comment and tell us how you actually like when, you know, if you went out, if you stayed in. I wish I went out. Huh? I wish I went out. No, you don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. We'll have the blitz. I don't care. And let us know. Happy New Year to all of you. Have a great 2024. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> just keep commenting and subscribing and We'll be happy, you'll be happy, and you'll have some weird content. Get your friends subscribing, your family. Your dog, your cat, if they've got a YouTube account. Should make Andy one and subscribe to us. <laughs> so, please. And you'll see the ever changing. Sometimes I look worse than this, sometimes I look a little bit better. So. Sometimes I, I mooch around in the background with a Mickey Mouse hoodie on. Yeah, it was quite amusing. It was like the above my makeup on. And I we'll look see, awful. We'll see what other recipes and weird concoctions we can come up with. Yeah, and if there's anything that any of you want to see, let us know. Because, you know, we're always, we're always after content. And we can do it for you. And then you'll get what you want to see and we'll have stuff to do. So, and also, we'll be doing the Mystical Elf 1.2. 0.2? 0.2. Because we, I lost the email address. Well, actually, I didn't. It was her email address. She lost her email address. So if you really want the, the Mystical Elf to restart, let us know. We've already... Well, no, live. We had um, a few people say that they wanted the Mystical Elf Clearly back. we had two people on our live, and they both said they wanted the Mystical Elf. That's a few people, yeah. I'm trying to make it sound like we have more, more viewers. <laughs> Shut up, right. We had three so, at one point, but the third one was only left for a couple of seconds. And then so two off. people we had viewing our live, thank you very much, um, said that they wanted um, the Miss Kalel back. So we'll see what everyone else... I mean, we'll probably do it anyway because you quite enjoy doing that, don't you? It was your channel and it was quite your calm place. No, not your calm. I mean, it was your <laughs> calm place. Well, I'd just get lost in cards and... And sometimes she'd swear on that and all. But then again, sometimes she swore on this one. I don't know if This is our family-friendly one and she keeps the game. I, look, I'm a cockney. I swear naturally in the flow of language. It just and blind and effing and jeffing. It just comes into it. And occasionally, with my language flow, I slip up. How many times you dropped the F bomb on here so far? About three times. But then again, we've been going quite a while, so for me, that's not bad. <laughs> I have dropped the F bomb about twice. I haven't sworn as much as you. But it wasn't just F bombs, she said, anyway. Mind you, I did say the S word when I was in uh, the Amina Hotel. Another word for stuff. Mm. And it's starting to get loud out there, so we are going to have to cut this short. But everybody, have a very, very happy 2024. And from the toilet bowl, Happy, happy New, New Year! Year!